Exhale to downward facing. Feet and legs together. As you inhale, draw a straight line back with your right leg. As you exhale, bring the knee to the nose and come forward into a high push-up position. Inhale, reach it back up, lift, lengthen. Exhale, knee to nose, come forward, way forward. Let the shoulders come over the ball of the hand. One more, inhaling up and exhaling back, knee to nose. Pause there, slide your right leg out to the side as close to the hand as you can. Keep the back toes tucked under and slowly start to lower your hip down onto the floor. Take your time. As you inhale, start to slide the left arm forward. Keep the right elbow bent in a chaturanga position, bent elbow position. Press the right hand into the floor. Twist your navel towards the right side and exhale, slowly release the head. Let the left forearm stay off the floor by drawing the shoulder back in and extending the arm out as far out as you can, pressing the hand into the floor. And then just keep rotating your navel towards the right hip. The whole body still breathing. Let your toes breathe. Let the back of your ears breathe. And exhale your organs toward your right side a little bit deeper. Maybe there's a lift. Maybe there's an undulation that happens organically. Find that. And then as you exhale, start to slide the left hand back. Pull it in. The torso will lift as you're ready. Pause here with both hands firmly on the ground. And as you inhale, push into the floor, lift the hip off the floor. Bend your right elbow and let it lift towards the sky. Let the arm unfold and push the floor away. Reach that arm to the back of the room and all the way down. Bring the knee to the nose. Lift the leg back up. And exhale, lower it down, downward dog. Bend the knees and come down onto all fours. And just pause here for a second, sitting on top of your shins. Let it go. Let any tension that you just picked up along the way, let it go. And then inhale yourself back up onto all fours. And as you exhale, lift back into downward dog. We'll try the other side, bringing the legs and feet together. Inhale, slide your legs slowly back with the inhale. Exhale, knee to nose, come forward. Inhaling back, lift. Exhale, knee to nose, come forward. Inhale, lift. Exhale, knee to nose, come forward and pause. Slide the left leg towards the right hand. Straighten that leg before you start to lower down onto the hip. Just slowly find your way down, keeping the back toes tucked under. And then slowly start to extend the right arm forward, keeping that forearm off the floor. Pressing the left hand into the floor, twist and rotate your navel towards the left side. And then find the wave. Don't let it get locked down. Don't think you have just arrived somewhere. It's just all in motion, all movement, all happening. The whole body breathing. Maybe that leg is able to lift up a little bit higher as you've deepened into the pose. Maybe not. Yeah, maybe the spine needs to unfurl a little bit and be more natural. And then as you inhale, start to walk yourself back. Mm, slowly lift the head and whole body at one time. And just pause there, having both hands firmly grounded Shoulders rolling back and down. As you inhale, breathe your hips off the floor. Bend the right elbow, lift it up to the sky and let the arm unfold from there and extend up and push away. Exhale that arm to the back of the room and all the way through and down. Bring the knee back to the nose. Lift the leg back up in the sky and exhale, pause and downward dog. 
Let's open our hands as wide as your mat and feet as wide as your mat and just take a deep breath in and out here with legs far apart and hands far apart and really lift your tailbone up towards the sky and melt your heart to the floor. Let any tension in your neck go, let it release. And as you exhale, bend your knees and come down onto all fours. And just pause sitting on your shins. 